Being desi isn't just what you wear or what you eat. It's an attitude, an emotion. It's what our future supermodels exuded oodles of when they lived desi last week. From weights out of akhadas to bird cages from villages to tongas straight out of Hindi songs, they posed, breathed and lived desi even though it was Alina who finally took home the Kalaba win. This week, their missions are about to get a lot more real. to this morning. The sun feels new, the air feels fresh. We're here in Daman at the fabulous Delton Resort and I feel alive. It's week three and the girls are getting better. They are living and coexisting with each other in an environment that could have otherwise been a little hostile. Embodying the theme of the week, live and let live. Oh my God, he's fucking hot. Buenos dias, it is the third week of the Kingfisher Supermodels competition and so far it's been really, really hard, really tough. Hey, hey, you, you, will you be my boyfriend? Erica won the first big win task and she got a huge GQ magazine feature and uh, I'm really jealous and I think the competition has really kicked in. Everyone's, you know, putting their best foot forward and uh, I am also here to win. So let's see how I roll in the next task. It's been two weeks full of emotions, surprises and a really good experience. It's my first competition into the modeling career. For me, it was really exciting. To me, live and let live means Live and let live. Is that the clue for this week's task? I'm sure about it, yes. So the look for today, uh, as you can see, they're straightening my hair right now and by the looks of things, the girls have got really heavy, dark um, eyes. There's just so many unexpected things in this competition, I really wouldn't be surprised if they did anything. We're going to both teach and learn an important lesson. We are about to introduce you ladies to your brand new BFFs, three gorgeous horses. You're going to get to feed them, groom them and interact with them. But remember, whilst you're doing all of that, take care and have loads of fun. It is the first task of the week and the girls who qualify for this will qualify for the big win task. <laughs> and making them look picture perfect is the young and talented photographer Gaurav Son. Son's expertise spans seven years of work in the fields of fashion, advertising and celebrity photography. He is perfect for this week at Kingfisher Supermodels because it touches upon not just one, but two of his passions, pictures and animals. Week 3, Task 1. The brief is to interact with the horses, be gentle, but give poses that are natural yet perfect. First up is Daphna. I've actually never worked with an animal before on set, so this was really challenging for me. Let's go. Ready, roll. I lose my mind down on the floor Don't waste my time, I need some more I don't need no brain. The biggest challenge was when, when the horse actually got a bit edgy 
and I just had to steer him a little bit and make him calm, you know? And so I, I found that a little bit of a challenge, just not knowing how the horse was going to react. I tried coming a little closer to the horse's head so that uh, we could basically see yeah, the waterfall in frame. So again, not looking too much into camera, but it's more like, you know, just laying, uh, laying next to him and just basically the photographer really wanted it to be natural and really uh, unposed. So I was really trying my best to be friendly with the horse so that it looked natural, so it looked like he was my, you know, my horse and that we were familiar with each other. A little more relaxed, a little more relaxed, less stressed. Let's get the next call in, please. Week 3, task 1 on Kingfisher Supermodels started as a disaster. And what are we doing? Just get really close to the horse, really intimate. The brief was to interact with the horses, groom them and yet have fun. Just grab his, grab his leash and get him a little closer. But the girls were stiff, not interactive and totally unimpressive. Just get the, the, get the bucket close to him and just caress him a little bit with the soap. A hose pipe was added as an element to get them revved up and alive. But alas, after two hours of trials and trying, Neha was called to salvage what seemed like a nightmare. Not bad at all, bright sunny day. Why wouldn't I like to believe that? Uh, from what I've seen and what I've heard, uh, the feedback that I'm getting, that it is not a bright and sunny day except for the weather. I mean, girls, it's week three, right? and you guys have done enough and more tasks. I don't see a few of you here. I wish everybody was here and paying attention to what I was saying because it's just really, really important that you follow the brief. How many of you do you think have followed the brief? It was about interacting with the horse. Do you think you did? Um, my horse, Rajkumar, he seemed pretty calm uh, as long as his caretaker was in front of him. The moment his caretaker moved away, he sort of started looking at him. So it was a little bit, like it was a little tricky calming him down again and bringing him back but eventually he came around eventually so it wasn't um, it wasn't like he was constantly moving away at least while I was doing my task. So you think Which the horse fine. came around did you girls come around is the question because all of you are not following the brief the brief is that you have to interact with the horse you have to go I don't understand why I was watching you know um, everybody and you're all like I'm seeing the results that we're getting you're either posing like this or like this or like this or like this. No, we don't want that. What we want is for you girls to follow the brief. You know, these tasks are not going to get any easier. And the brief is something that we want you to stick with. What do you think? How did you do, Amrita? I tried following it, but um, I don't know. It, that sometimes I was losing the contact because the horse was moving a lot. So I tried my best to be calm and gentle to the horse and also try making a good picture. So that I'm waiting for the results. Let's see. Yeah, well, we're all waiting for the results, but having said that, I don't think any of you were shining through in this task. Either you girls have to buck up and do better, or I don't know what else to say, because we're looking for somebody who shines through. We haven't seen anyone in this task. It's almost embarrassing, because I'm here on the other end saying, oh, you girls are getting better with every task, and you girls are doing so beautifully, and you know, you're looking amazing, but what's the point of all that if you're not going to perform? All right, girls, seriously. You know, get your act together and look like supermodels. Follow the brief, use your bodies and more importantly, use your brains. So a second chance to perform the task has been given to the girls by Neha. And the first one up to prove her mettle is Manaz. I want to take some time, maybe like about two to three minutes to just get to know the horse a little better because I'm sure they're like in a little bit of a frenzy, they're a little bit edgy because there's so many people around, there's like, there's thermocall and there's uh, cameras, so like flashes are happening and whatnot. So I just want to take some time to maybe just, you know, calm him down a little bit, just get to, get to, get him used to having me around. So it's a nice thing that she's um, getting friendly. Yeah. Hey Manas, I'm Gaurav, nice to meet you. So, we've got this beautiful, beautiful animal here. We've got to take some nice pictures of him. So just do your own thing, no posing. Get out of the yeah. region, I think it's no, no, it's fine, it's fine. So just basically be yourself and uh, you can just try doing, like getting a little wet, 
uh, soap him up a little bit, but not like overly this. It's just just for yeah, 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 yeah. You can just on his head just caress him. Get a little closer, get a little closer, yeah, you can have your body touch his body, yeah, that's perfect. So it's a little more natural, that's perfect, lovely, good job. But there's a price Has some experience with horses because when he was up close and taking like even close up portraits or anything, and you know, his flash was going off. I think his deme demeanor and all is really calm and sober, so it didn't sort of psych Rajkumar out, even though he was right in front of his face. So, I think that was really great about the way he worked that he, he manages to, you know, not sort of infiltrate into the horse's space, which is great. Gently, you can just yeah brush him. Yeah, nice, good job. With your body, just try facing me a little more. Not necessarily your face. Yeah, with the body, that's good. That's awesome. The horse's name is Raj Kumar. I spent some time with him right before I started my task. So I think he got a little bit used to me and everything. And I got completely wet, I think, which is why I thoroughly enjoyed myself. When I entered the location, I saw a stable with beautiful, pretty horses. And I'm an animal lover, so I'm really looking forward to, you know, just go gaga with the horse, feed him and play with him. So the horses were pretty scared while I was touching them so I was making them comfortable first so that I can also be comfortable while posing with them. Comfortable with the horses, that's great. Let's just continue with the same vibe. Just caress them, uh, play with them, just have fun, yeah? So I don't want any posy pictures. You can look into the camera once in a while but try just let it be about you and the horse, yeah? Awesome. while doing the task was uh, when I was playing with the holes and water was all over me I was so happy like you know it was, I was feeling really stress free at that moment I was just you know in that moment I just got lost in that water and happiness Sita looks really cute and it looks like she's having fun. I think, yeah, uh, oh, yeah, she is having fun. Uh, considering the performance I just gave, I think uh, I have a fair chance of, you know, making it to the shortlist. When I entered and I started uh, keeping my hand on him and I felt him, I felt nice. It's like a very cute and calm animal, so yeah, that was the wow moment. I'm really scared, I don't want to do this. I reckon they should just not include me in this task and I'd be much happier. I don't want you to look into camera most of the times. Just very naturally, you can lean against him, you can 
Yeah, just caress him gently. Yeah, that's perfect. Lovely. Amrita is really doing. Is she's trying hard, but it's difficult, you know. And I think uh, all of us are dealing with a horse for the first time. I'll try hard. I, I don't know what I get to do. Um, I'm sure I don't want to give him a bath. Well, maybe um, I'll feed him. Let's see. Okay, Amrita, we're done. Thanks so much for the cooperation. I have always told this, and I will keep on saying the same thing that uh, I always give my hundred percent to whatever. Uh, it depends on the judges, and I truly, totally respect their decision. If they think I'm good enough, I'll definitely make it. If they don't think, then it's good enough as well for me. Uh, initially, maybe you know, I was concentrating on myself more than the horse. Then uh, I quickly changed, and I think uh, that was very quick. Come on this side if you want. Let him, let him. Come on this side. Come around. I was uh, going around, maybe sometimes on the left side of the horse or right side of the horse, and I was just checking out his mood. So when he really wanted to turn on his left, I. I Went to the right, and I, I kind of, you know, read his mind and his mood, and uh, performed accordingly. We're done. Come, let's go. Yeah, we had fun. We got some really nice shots. Yep, yep. Gaurav really made it easy because um, I was I was just trying to interact with the horse, and I was not my my concentration was the horse and nothing else. So at that point of time, he moved, he clicked his shots, and he finally said, "Okay, Swapnil, I got it." Like it was very quick. They came, they saw, but conquering was a long way away. The first task started disastrously. Then Neha worked her magic, and it was Veni Vidi Vici all the way. Manas, Nikita, Swapnila, and Amrita have all played their hand, and now it's up to the others to win or to lose this. Coming up, a Daphna, Alina, and Anuki trying to bring the horse to the water.